Is your specific person still not conforming? Just do this. Namaste, my friends. Welcome back to another video. My name is Matt Elsie. Thank you for stopping by to manifest with me today. In this video, I wanna share with you if your specific person is still not conforming to your ideals, to your desires, to the way you want them to be, what's another way you can do this? So this was a video I posted Oh, about a week ago or so, and I got a lot of questions of people that maybe were kind of having trouble with the way I explained it. So I want to explain it in a, a different way, because before I was talking about basically visualizing, seeing them as you want them to be, saying certain things to yourself as the way you want them to be. But I want to share with you another way that might be a little bit easier for those that struggle with, with visualizing or really um, speaking affirmations and things like that. So we'll get to that in this video. Before we do though, if you have not already, there is a spot available for you to sign up for my powerful seven day Neville Goddard manifestation mastery course. If you're interested in changing your life in the next seven days, starting out the new year with a bang, there's a link in the top of the description box below. Click it and sign up. You'll also get access to a private Facebook group that I'm a part of, so you can pick my brain, you can talk to me, um, and I'm gonna help you manifest all your biggest dreams and all your biggest goals. Again, link in the top of the description box below. Sign up and I will see you there. Okay, so if you're still having trouble getting your specific person to conform to the way that you want them to be, right? How you want them to act, what you want them to think. And I talked about in the video uh, about a week ago, you know, you can close your eyes and visualize you having an interaction with them where they are acting the way you want them to be, okay? Or you can say certain things to yourself as to, of course they love me, of course they wanna be with me, of course they wanna text me, right? And, and kind of get them to conform to that new direction that you want them to be. We talked about, remember, the star of the movie, you're choosing their role, rewrite their role how you want them to be. But if you're struggling with this, there's another way you can do this. And this is kind of fun. It's kind of powerful. It kind of puts you again in that stance of confidence to show your power that you're up here and everyone else is down here, that you choose the contents of your life. You choose the roles in your movie. And that's simply mentally telling that specific person how you want them to be. Mentally telling them how you want them to be. So literally thinking about how you want them to be and mentally saying it to them. So mentally you say something like, you love me. You want to talk to me. You want to spend time with me. You want to go on dates with me. You want to ask me out. Tell them what they're thinking, but also tell them what they're gonna do. You are going to text me. You are going to call me. You are gonna comment on my social media photos. You are gonna spoil me. You love spoiling me. You love talking to me. You're gonna call me today. You can go beyond with just a specific person. If you're in a situation, you are gonna give me that job. You are gonna sign those closing papers on this house. Again, mentally demand, mentally tell them what they think and what they're gonna do. Talk to them, that's it. As you do this, picture them in your mind. Picture them in your mind and just say that to them. You love me. Of course you're gonna ask me out. Of course you're gonna text me back. Of course you're gonna be with me. Of course you're gonna spoil me. Of course you're gonna be there for me. You love me, you can't stop thinking about me. I'm always on your mind. You have a burning passion to get my attention, to talk to me. Say it directly to them. You don't have to visualize, you don't have to kind of feed yourself certain thoughts. Just be blunt. Say it directly to them, mentally. Picture them and say it. What do you want them to be? How do you want them to feel about you? What do you want them to do? This can work with your specific person for love. This can work in a specific situation, a school test. You're gonna give me that A plus, whatever the case is. You have the power to mentally change everything about your reality. The problem is most people don't do it. They leave it up the chance. They say, well, I hope this happens, but I don't think so because this usually happens like this and this usually happens like that. And so it turns out negative for them. You are the creator of your reality. You are the architect of your life. You choose its contents. You are the director of this movie. You choose everyone's roles. How do you want them to be? What do you want them to think? How will they conform to your ideals? You create it. And as soon as you start doing that, you will see the reflection. You will see it happen. You will see it change. Your specific person will conform to however you want them to be in your life life. If you want to take this idea a step further, if you want to learn about how to be delusional in order to manifest your specific person, it sounds silly, but if you can master it, you'll never have any problem ever manifesting a specific person ever again. I'm going to share it with you in this video here, so be sure to check it out 
next. <laughs>